What's up everyone, Jossie here. And in today's video, we're gonna be doing an apartment tech tour in our new apartment in the New York City, New Jersey area. I wanna give a special shout out to today's sponsor, Asus. We recently moved from the Midwest to the East Coast. So this is our new 800 square foot apartment. Listen, it was almost impossible trying to find an apartment that was over 800 square feet that had amenities, renovated with nice appliances, and a solid layout that is open concept with good lighting. You know, the type of place that a content creator would need. One of my favorite spaces in this apartment is the kitchen. And that's because I spend a decent amount of time making coffee, tea, and cooking. I'm not sure if you can tell since I'm using a wide angle lens for most of these B-roll shots, but the kitchen is pretty small and that's fine with us because we prefer having a larger living space. The cabinets are pretty tall. They get almost as high as the ceiling. Definitely optimized for storage since we don't have that much space. One other really nice thing about this kitchen is the water dispenser so we don't need water bottles or an ice maker or a brita anymore which really saves space thank you to asus for gifting me the asus zen wi-fi ax 6600 wi-fi 6 mesh system the zen wi-fi system consists of a pair of asus ax 66 hundred routers packed with technology that gives you super fast reliable and secure internet wi-fi connections inside and outside of your home one really nice feature that the asus router app offers is the ability to prioritize what application your zen wi-fi mesh system caters to whether that be gaming media streaming working from home learn from home web surfing and file transferring i really love the way this pair of wi-fi mesh routers look the white colorway is really clean and minimal with a rib design on both sides of the router. Actually looks good enough to be placed in the living room or kitchen. Since I spend so much time working from home, whether that's programming, answering emails and instant messages from my day job, or uploading large YouTube videos on YouTube Studio, I also can't forget streaming content from our smart TV and playing the PS5 online. Wi-Fi has become more important than ever. Overall, I'm really satisfied with this Asus Wi-Fi mesh system. I really like having a reliable network that's secure, fast, along with being able to customize my Wi-Fi based on whatever application benefits me at a given moment, whether that be gaming, file transfer, or just simply answering messages and emails while working from home. Thank you to Asus for sponsoring this video. One of the newer tech items that we added to the apartment are these nano leaf wood elements that you see behind me. One thing you'll notice in this apartment tech tour is that a lot of the technology that we added was lighting that we could control with our phones. These hexagon shaped panels really enhance our space and the design fits in really well with our aesthetic. From the home app, you can choose from a range of warm to cool lighting options to illuminate your space with a natural glow and really create this environment of inspiration. Since the panels are modular, you can create a personalized lighting experience by arranging the panels into any configuration you want. There's also a control panel with touch buttons that you can use to find the ideal ambience. You can toggle between the different nature inspired lighting. There's a shuffle control as well that allows you to shuffle between different glowing illuminations for each panel along with a music option where each panel will glow based on the rhythm of the beat from the music you're listening to inside your home. The Govi Smart LED light bars have been a great addition to the living room area, making our television experience so much better. It's really easy to pair your light bars to the Govi app through Bluetooth. Once paired, you have full control over your light bars with the ability to turn them on or off along with an insane amount of lighting customization options. I can't even imagine a television experience without having LED 
light behind my TV. There's the effects lab with over 20 different color variations. I actually use this setting the most, trying to find the perfect ambience and color based on what we're watching on TV or how we're feeling. There's also five different modes to select lighting options from where you can change the sensitivity, saturation, change the color, using a color wheel, save color, and white balance. The PS5 is my go-to for gaming. The experience is just so immersive with haptic feedback from the DualSense controller. With the addition of the LG C1, my gaming experience has been remarkable because of the 4K OLED and 120 Hertz display for a smooth gaming experience. I still do have an Xbox, but it's a Series S and the PS5 gaming experience is just significantly better, especially when it comes to playing my favorite games like Madden and 2K. I actually picked up the consistently sold out DualSense charger recently at an Amazon four star store in New York City. It's honestly one of the more underrated tech items I have. My controller batteries used to always be dead because I would always forget to charge them via USB-C. But now that I have a dedicated charging station with the DualSense charger, the battery is consistently full. Believe it or not, the TV has never been the focal point of our apartment slash living room tech setup. I always was of the mindset that TVs have gotten so much better. You don't really need to spend north of $700 for one until I experienced OLED and QLED TVs with Dolby Atmos and Vision. We recently picked up the LG C1 2021 and by recently, I mean literally like a week or two ago and we absolutely love this TV. This is a major upgrade from our previous Samsung 65 inch 700 series TV. The display is so vibrant and bright, it really illuminates the space around it. Also the clarity of shows that have Dolby Vision technology make you feel as if you're experiencing what you're watching in real life. The colors are so accurate and the blacks are very deep, adding incredible contrast and believe it or not, the anti-glaring is pretty good. One thing I really like about this TV are the viewing angles. Even in the kitchen or from the side, the image looks accurate. There's not much color shift or brightness loss, regardless of where you're seating or where your viewing angle is. Overall, I'm very impressed with the LG C1, and if you'd like to see a gaming or TV setup in the future, be sure to give this video a thumbs up, comment down below, and consider subscribing for more content like this.